Good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you are. On today's video, I want to show you how you can easily resize images using Canva for all your social media. So where you, what you do is you create one image in Canva and then you can quickly, easily resize that image and save those files down to be able to then use across other areas of your social media. But why, why, would, why do you want to do that? And one of the things that I see very often on people's social media is that they'll take an image and they just then share that same image and they don't understand how those images need to be resized to be better viewed across social media. So you might be well aware that things like uh, Instagram have a one by one crop and also a four by five crop. And if you have it on a four by five crop, then that will mean that you get more real estate and you can get more interaction with your image. Um, but yeah, let's dive into Canva. What we've got here in Canva is some images that I've just created. So you might want to, let's just take this image for example. So this one I've got as a Facebook image. And if I wanted to also share that on my Instagram, I just come over here and I'll show more and I can do a Instagram post. And you know, I can select multiple ones at the same time. If you're doing blog posts, you might want to also uh, create a pin and you can do that. That's uh, 1000 by 1500 uh, pixel. Twitter post is a 1024 by 512. And you'll see all these when you use uh, Canva um, and you can just resize them. You can resize them to whatever you like to resize them to. But for now, let's have a look at Instagram post. So if I click copy and resize, that'll then just resize it. And this is now a one by one crop. And you'd be like, well, hang on a minute, Darren, you've got these areas at the top here, but all you need to do is just quickly just adjust the area you can do the same down here. You can either extend the image or you can shift and select to move those images down. And yeah, and then you just save that down however you want to save that. You can save it as a PNG, JPEG, um, or anything else like that you that you want. If you wanted to, you can add animation on there. Um, but we'll come on to that in a future video. This is just a quick video that I wanted to show you on how to resize the images. So you just don't forget to rename that one. So if I wanted to rename this, I could rename it free help for local businesses and I'd call it IG post. And then I just click save on that. Don't have any transparent background areas. There you go. That's now using Canva. That's allowed me to quickly and easily resize the image to be able to be shared. And what I can do then is I can come in here if I want to do the same promotion across multiple networks. So what I'm doing here really is kind of repurposing the content. Um, what we can do is we can come in and say you can also start typing it into here that you want to do the same promotion across Twitter. So you say, right, well, I want a Twitter post. Come in, copy it, resize it. And you'll see this one, this one's a little bit wider. Um, but we'll come in, we'll rename it up here. We say for Twitter post. So come in and we want to quickly resize that for Twitter. I can resize this as well. So my text is a lot bigger. 
and you can be a bit bit more precise than I'm being at the moment on this um, and the thing is, is sometimes the images don't quite work I've, I've gone far too big on that image there let's bring that down a little bit and bring it across so you'll see sometimes the images need to, need to play about with the images a little bit you might need might be that you need to change a particular photograph if it's not quite fitting um, it depends on the aspect ratio that you're taking your picture and how much space you've got on there but then you can come in and you can just quickly resize this move that about and there you go so that's it for today that's your quick tips on how you can easily resize your images as a small business or as anybody really um, and share the same images across your social media thank you very much and i'll see you soon